Hello everybody, it is June 9th today and I have made it to my next hotel. I am in Kyoto right now and I'm at the Pocket Hotel and it's so nice in here. So I want to give you guys a little hotel tour but also just want to give you a quick update because it is already 4 p.m. So this morning I checked out of my last hotel and I took the bullet train and train and whatnot and I made it here at like 1 but check-in wasn't till 3 so then I was honestly just editing my vlog for like 3 hours hours i finally finished it all i have to do is just upload it and schedule it so that it'll be ready for you guys different with my hair today it's in this ponytail and I don't know how I feel about this look you guys I've been having a hair crisis I'm just into the bun recently just on the top of my head and just have my hair out of my face I think a big reason is because my hair is in a really awkward length right now because I'm growing it out from having it short and also it's hot outside so I don't really want to have my hair down で、なんか暑くなってきてるから最近はお団子にハマってるのでいつもそれにしてるんですけど So anyways, yeah, it was kind of a hectic morning, but at least I got my video done and I just feel really productive and I think today I'm just going to try and edit another vlog and just be ahead of my schedule and stuff. Just cuz I like that feeling and also today is like kind of like a a transportation day so I just think I'm just gonna get a quick bite at some kind of restaurant nearby and then I'm gonna continue to edit and just be in the zone today so that I can fully enjoy myself for the next three day no four nights five days I think I'm here あの、ちょっとさっとご飯を食べに行こうと思うんですけど、もう一つのブログも編集してすごいいっぱい今日終わらして、で、4泊5日なのでま明日もいっぱい遊べるように今日はもうずっともう移動の1日だったから、だからこ
a bunch of like content. So you can see washroom usage and then you can see like one person's using the washroom but the other ones are open which I think is very interesting and good to know. And then I don't know just a little spot where you can put your stuff down. Lots of hangers and look at how spacious it is. I hope you can tell on camera how big this place is. We have some storage for your luggage down here and it's just really nice. It comes with this little desk, which I appreciate because, you know, I'm always on my computer. My stuff is just here, I haven't unpacked anything. And you need this key in order to get into the washrooms, into the shower rooms, on the elevator. You need this for everything. I actually really like that you need that key card for wherever you go because I didn't know this was a shared floor with like men or guys. Um, so I just feel a lot safer knowing that I have two locks it's an auto lock door but it also has two manual locks on it and you need that key card to get wherever so i feel a lot safer with that which i appreciate でもこのキーカードがあることでちょっとなんか安心感があるなと思ってあのダンスと同じフロアみたいなのが私は知らなかったんですよでもこのドアもオートロックだしそれあとマニュアルで自分でやるロックも2つあってあのキーカードないとお
I just need some fruit in my life. I love fruit and I'm always eating it in Vancouver, so I just always grab pineapple or apple. It's usually my go-to here. お風呂入って寝ようと思います。今日はあまり京都あちこち見なかったけど、今日はさっき言ったように移動の日だったので、Tomorrow I'm going to be going on a whole adventure. I'm going to do some research tonight of like places I should go to and go see. But yeah, today I didn't really see much of Kyoto. Yeah, it was just a transporting day and I wanted to get a lot of editing done, so I'm going to be editing now and then I'm going to shower and go to bed. That pretty much does it for this vlog. But before I close it out, I wanted to tell you guys that I had a pretty long phone call with my mom earlier and I was just showing her this hotel and everything. It's been on my mind a lot about how I feel like I need to figure everything out before I get home and I mentioned that I think before... Did I mention that today? I don't even remember. I just feel like I need to have a plan going home or else I'm going to be completely lost and I can already feel myself kind of spiraling once I get back. So... I was kind of telling her about that and she told me that I should just live in the moment and enjoy the now and not let that, you know, stop me from having a good time here. She's definitely right and I haven't let it like get in the way of like my everyday adventures here, you know, like I've been doing a lot and I've been seeing a lot and it's been amazing. Yeah, usually when I get back to my hotel, that's the thing that I'm thinking about, like not really wanting to go home and also it just feels like I'm probably gonna get slapped in the face with reality kind of thing and I'm afraid of that. Moms are always right and um, I'm definitely gonna take her advice. I'm trying to not think about it too much, you know, like I'm trying to live in the now but I'm just so worried about the future and um, it just sounds kind of cheesy but yeah, that's just kind of how I'm feeling at the moment. まあ、全然 Anyways, sorry that this vlog was not very adventurous, but um, this is just the reality of traveling and vlogging and editing at the same time. Yeah, today was kind of a chill day, but tomorrow is going to be super fun, so I hope you tune in. Make sure you subscribe to this channel so you don't miss any of the Kyoto content that is coming. Make sure you like this video if you enjoyed it. So if you guys are having a wonderful day, thank you so much for letting me talk and vent to you guys. And yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Jenny, bye!